hello youtube and welcome to this video in this video we're gonna learn how we can create a fade in and fade out effects out of our c sharp application so let's begin i'm gonna be using a windows form for this video so let's name it fade So here is our form. We need a timer. And let's change the background. This looks good. Now we need this timer to be true so when the application start the timer starts with it and now in the event section in the tick double click it and this would create the timer tick event inside this event we're gonna decrease the opacity of our application so first our opacity would be zero we would keep our opacity as zero and then here we're gonna increase it little by little so we're gonna increase the opacity by So we increase our opacity by 0.2 it would mean 20% so the timer would be ticking again and again and again and it would increase the opacity again and again but we had to stop it uh, after uh, the opacity is 100% so we're gonna give it a condition which would be if opacity equal equals to 1 which means uh, the opacity equals to 100 agar as a, uh, if the opacity is uh, equals to 100 then uh, close the timer then stop the tick event so if the opacity equals to 1 stop stop what stop the timer so stop the timer so we need this condition to stop the timer and this would be would keep incre uh, incrementing the opacity of the application so now let's check it now you see the uh, uh, fade in effect but it was too slow so we're gonna make the timer a little fast i i have turned it from 100 millisecond to 10 milliseconds now let's check it it was uh, way too fast let's turn it to 30 and that was cool I'm gonna make it a little more slower so you guys can see so here is our fade in effect now for the fade, uh, fade out effect I need another timer it would take when the application is closed so I'm gonna be changing border style as none and create a new button exit 
by clicking it the second timer would go on and inside the second timer tick event I'm gonna do something like this but instead of incrementing the opacity I'm gonna decrement the opacity and here I'm gonna be saying if opacity equals to 0 exit the application so this dot close this would close the application when the opacity is 0 or less than 0 so inside the exit I just need to start the timer the second timer now I should set the value as well and I'm gonna keep port at 40 so now let's check it here is our fade in effect and here is our fade out effect this looks just perfect fade in and fade out so these our uh, these were our fade in and fade out effects thanks for watching the video do subscribe to the channel and like the video if uh, press the like button if you like the video and see you next time